Well, when I discovered the illness, it feels like a curse. That's at least how I felt. But in this video, I'm gonna tell you tips to make it better. But before everything, please click on the like button and subscribe if you want to see more content about how the illness because because it takes only seconds to you. But for me, it makes me really happy. Well, the first tip is something kind of polemic that is to shape yourself regularly well i know that there's a lot of pressure uh, mostly between women to get to get shape and i know that you might be feel comfortable but at least for me it really helped me every time i took longer to shape myself i would get a lot of formations so it doesn't really matter how you shape you can use machines or you can use walks but please and it can be hurtful at first but I promise you that it's worth it because it gets really better. I shake myself every one to two weeks, but that's up to you. The second tip is something that some people may find kind of unnecessary, but there's a lot of people that are in that place, so they don't make, so they don't really take care of themselves. But this is something really important. I know that a lot of you probably heard something like, "Oh, you have this. It's not you. It's just because you don't shake, you don't take showers, something like that." And I listen to you. Even though the formations are not equal to um, to dirty, when you don't take showers regularly, you probably will get more informations than other people. Um, try to take shower one shower every day, and I promise you that gonna really provide. If you don't eat healthy, it's kind of hard to not have informations if you don't have you take medications because it's really direct to the illness. Every time you may not realize now, but every time. A lot of bad and stuff. You probably get information in the next days. You know, don't really feel happy to say that. So the diet is really big to the end, sadly. So try to not eat a lot of like chocolate and fast food because these are the biggest responsible to trigger the illness. And another thing that helps you is exercises. If you have problems with taking showers, which is something really okay because because everybody has different life. The workouts are really gonna help you because you're gonna sweat a lot. So and it's okay to start with like one minute workouts. Yeah, yes. I started with five minutes, but now it's really okay for me to do forty minutes. So don't worry, don't worry, just stick slow and you're gonna do just try, just try. This thing is really important. Um, I'm not a doctor, you probably may realize now. You really need to take care of about the deodorant because every time I use a cheap one, I get a lot of information, serious information. And I don't know the relation, but since my most affected area by the is the arm, yeah. If you use deodorants, try to not use the cheapest one. And if you use, please make sure to take shower every day because if you don't clean the area after using the deodorant, you stop your armpit armpit to spray. So it's gonna have information. There is something they don't want. I don't use deodorant, I use something they're gonna put here because I don't know in English. But but if you use just really make sure to clean the area well and use the shower. I guess that's enough for today. If you have doubts or something about the illness, some questions, you can put a comment here. They're gonna reply you. That's it for today. These tips really helped me. I had to learn, like, after having a lot of formations, having, like, scares, something, and I don't want that to happen to you too. So, please, follow at least one. I promise that it's gonna be better. Thanks for watching. Bad.